Thank you. Let's have a little bit of a prepared statement here. Um, hello, my name is Rachel Lydia Rand. I'm a jazz trombonist, multi-instrumentalist, composer, and software engineer. I've been running my website dot trombone for twenty dot trombone dot com for twenty five years. I'm going to try to keep this short tonight. In order to fight climate change and the inevitable end of oil, a substance which we use to pave our roads and shingle our houses and make thousands of other products, I'm suggesting that we drop our population rather rapidly by asking Generation Z to have just one child for every two women. That would create a glut of housing and put us into a, an entirely different economic system. I'm also suggesting we give up the rat race, work as little as possible, work from home when possible, and drive cars a lot less than we are now. Human activity causes climate change. If we want to stop emissions from going up, we should do it with my proposals rather than building up a wind, solar, and battery e economy to support 10 billion people. I'm suggesting we play sports in our parks and music in our homes instead of running the rat race. So, you know, I can't prove that climate change is, is a problem. We hear a lot about it, you know. Um, this rat race culture, um, to, to me is, is pretty insane. I, I'm a bicyclist com commuter and, you know, biking in a sea of cars uh, just, it just seems so wasteful in, the, in this country and all. But, um, you know, we're kind of a democracy here and, you know, uh, people ask for what they want and we get re represented that way. But it seems like Mother Nature doesn't really uh, have a vote in, in this system. Um, you know, uh, I don't know, you know, I can't prove this, but uh, um, that's what I'm running on, you know. I, I think, um, um, you know, drawing, it, it's like oil, you know. We, we separate it in all these layers, and part of it gets to pave the roads, and part of it gets to make products, part of it is jet fuel, and part of it is um, gasoline in our cars. If we, if we make electric cars and start using the, the gasoline and all, then uh, um, and we keep the other products up to this level. Then we'll, what do we do with all the gasoline? Then you know we're going to have to burn it or put it back in the ground, which probably isn't a good idea. So uh, you know we hear a lot about that in the news, or at least I do. Um, you know, uh, so if we just draw down everything evenly and reduce our population, then it seems like uh, you know we, we can make a difference here and get our population down to two billion by. 2099 if we keep up this rate for 40 years. Uh, I've been reading that our population was 2 billion uh, back in 1950. And, you know, it makes sense that we would reverse course like this. I'm Rachel Lydia Rand. Uh, we appreciate your vote. Thank you.